So you want to add more RAM to Minecraft 1.18.2. Honestly, I think that's great because uh, RAM is a very easy way to, in a lot of ways, reduce lag in Minecraft. So we're going to show you exactly how to do that in this video, how to add more RAM. But before we can do that, you probably should see how much RAM Minecraft has dedicated to it in the first place. And to do that, you simply want to hit F3 in game and boom, this right here will pop up. In the top right up here, you can see exactly how much RAM you have. And by default, it will be 2,000 megabytes, also known as 2 gigabytes. 2 gigabytes is 2,048 megabytes. We're going to upgrade this to four gigabytes in this video, and we're also going to talk about exactly how much RAM you should have in Minecraft, depending on whether you're playing vanilla, modded, all of that stuff. And then we're even going to show you how to see how much RAM your ha computer has total, because you never want to dedicate more than half of your computer's total RAM to Minecraft. However, before we get into all of that, here's a message from our sponsor, Apex Minecraft Host. And go to the first link down below, the breakdown.xyz slash Apex to start your very own 24-hour DDoS protected Minecraft server. We love it just Apex so much that we host our own server, play.breakdowncraft.com on them. So go ahead and check out Apex, the first link down below, the breakdown.xyz slash Apex to get your own server up and running. However, you're here to add more RAM to Minecraft. So to do that, now that you know how to see how much RAM you exactly have in Minecraft, again, that was just hitting F3 in game. That's it. That's all it takes. Nevertheless, though, to do that, you want to come to the Minecraft launcher here. Then you want to click on installations. Then you want to select the installation you want. If this is a modded installation, it's going to work the exact same way as a vanilla installation. So Optifine, Forge, Fabric, or vanilla. Latest release here, which is what we're going to do. All of them work exactly the same way. Nonetheless, we're going to go over here to the right-hand side on the installation you want, click on the three dots, click on edit, and then once we're here, you want to go ahead and click on more options. Finally, scroll down, and under JVM Arguments, you'll have this, XMX 2G. 2G being the amount of RAM you have dedicated to Minecraft. So if we want to update that to 4G or 4 gigabytes, boom, there we go. Like I said, by default, and what we saw earlier, it was 2 gigabytes. That's why it says 2G. Change this to 4G, boom, you now have 4 gigabytes dedicated to Minecraft. How much should you dedicate? And by the way, once you've changed this, make sure you do click save and you're going to go. You have added more RAM to Minecraft. Now, how much RAM should you add? Well, that kind of depends on what you want to do. Modded Minecraft, especially huge mod packs with over 100 mods, a lot of times can need 8 gigabytes of RAM to run efficiently. However, vanilla Minecraft usually can run off just 2 gigabytes of RAM, but just to be safe, you can upgrade it to 4. Things like shaders and stuff like that also like having four gigabytes of RAM just to give them a little more space for buffering and things of that nature. So overall, vanilla Minecraft usually can run on two gigabytes. Shaders and some upgrades like that would like about four gigabytes of RAM and even some light modding and things, four gigabytes is a safe place to be. However, heavy extensive modding can take eight gigabytes and in some cases can take more. However, you should never dedicate more than half your computer's RAM to Minecraft. How do you see how much RAM your computer has? Well, come up here to the top left of my screen, bottom left of your screen, or center of your screen on Windows 11. Click on that little Windows icon, type in system information right there, system information. Go ahead and open that app up. And then in this app, we want to find installed physical memory. So right there it is for me, 64 gigabytes. That's how much RAM my computer has. That means in theory, I can dedicate 32 gigabytes of RAM to Minecraft and still be okay because you should never dedicate more than half of your computer's RAM as a general rule of thumb. Well, that being said, though, that's insane. Minecraft will never need 32 gigs of RAM. However, I could easily dedicate 10 gigs if I was running a very, very extensive mod pack. Let's say you had 16 gigabytes, though. Your max would be 8 gigabytes because that's half of your PC's memory. Last but not least, if you do upgrade your RAM there and it just doesn't work for some reason, and like it's still saying 2 gigabytes or maybe even less in Minecraft, or Minecraft doesn't open up all after you've installed more RAM to it and added more RAM, that's because you don't have this. If you have anything other than x64, specifically if you have x86 listed as your system type, that means you have a 32-bit operating system, which means you can't add more than 2 gigs of RAM to Minecraft, and really your computer I don't think can have more than 4 gigs of RAM in general. Nevertheless, though, we can now go ahead and click play on latest release, which is where we added more RAM, and I'll meet you on Breakdown Craft to show you that more RAM is installed. Back in Breakdown Craft here, if we go ahead and press F3, boom, there it is in the top right, 4 gigabytes of RAM now dedicated, specifically 4,096 megabytes, which translates to 4 gigs of RAM. If you had added 6, it would be starting with 6 and then some numbers after it, but overall, 1,024 megabytes is what makes up 1 gigabyte, so times that by 4 and there's the number for you. Awesome stuff. If you have any questions, let us know in the comment section down below. That is how you can add more RAM to Minecraft 1.18.2. Again, never add more than half your computer's RAM. Minecraft, by default, two gigabytes is usually enough, four gigabytes for things like shaders, and up to eight gigabytes for extensively modded Minecraft. My name is Nick. This has been The Breakdown. See you in the next video. Come play on Breakdown Craft. It truly is an amazing Minecraft server. We'll see you in the next video. I'm out. Peace.